good morning. It is uh, <clears throat> day 16 of Vlogmas and we are heading out to get some donuts from the donut shop this morning. Sounded really good. We skipped the gym. We're gym skippers because mama needed some sleep. Did daddy need some sleep? Wow, my gosh. He came on like full force, but anyway, we're gonna go get some donuts. <coughs> Good, how are you? Good. Good. Can I get um, two sausage, egg, and cheese pancakes? Okay. And then half a dozen donuts. Can I get three blueberry glazed and then three regular glazed, please? Okay. Thank you. They like remember everything you order here. They don't write anything down and they never get it wrong. It's like really crazy. You could have the biggest order, and they're always right. No, thank you. Okay. Okay. We got them. So these have been our go-to from the donut shop. They are pancakes with, it sounds weird really because we put syrup on it, but it's actually so delicious. They have cheese in it, which is why it sounds kind of weird to me. But cheese, sausage, does it have egg? Mm -hmm. Yeah, an egg in here, I couldn't remember, with um, pancakes on each side, like a pancake sandwich and syrup on it. It is so good. And then we get donuts. Um, hard to show because they're in this bag today, but the glazed donuts and at the bottom and there is blueberry glaze. They are the best ever. The donuts there are literally the best ever. They are the best donuts. They're just like unbelievable. So we love to get them as a little, little treat. Usually we get them on Sundays, but it's Wednesday and we just decided to have a treat. Yeah, we didn't go this past Sunday. Actually, did we go the week before? I don't remember. I think you might have, but we didn't go this past Sunday because we had like the practice and everything for the Christmas program and they actually close early. They close like one or something like that. So we have to get there as soon as church is over or we don't get to get it. So, well, as soon as we can get out of church anyway. Okay, so I'm making a cup of water. I wanted to show you what I'm doing um, because I'm gonna try something different. <laughs> And I don't know how it's gonna work, but we're gonna try it out. I've told you guys that I um, didn't used to be good at drinking water, and then I got that big, like, a half gallon thing of water that, or not of water, but the thing of water in, that you um, have, like, the times on, it keeps track, and that really helped me. Like, I've never drank as much water as I have been. Um, and now that I'm pregnant, I wanna make sure that I stay on top of that. I'm just. I'm the type of person, honestly, that I have to really intentionally do that. I'm not a person that, like, is thirsty a lot or wants to drink something all day. Um, and particularly water, I have to really, like, say, okay, from I'm going to drink this much water right now. Like, I have to plan it out. It's just how I have to do it. So, sometimes I just get tired of plain water, especially, like, I haven't been drinking, um, like, pops and different things like that like I was before, I mean, I'll have like a sip of Sprite or ginger ale or something, but, um, you know, I haven't really been drinking a lot of that. I had a sparkling water yesterday, which was really, really good. <laughs> it actually really helped just to get, I like that burn feeling, you know, and so that kind of helped. Um, but I am going to make water, like cold water, ice water, with some frozen strawberries in it. I was reading about people doing it, and I know some people put it in like those little bottles that have like the little part you know what i'm talking about where you put the fruit in there i can't think of what that's called there's a word for that i'm just slipping my mind completely but it kind of like puts the fruit in there without the actual fruit being in the water 
but I'm just gonna put it in the water. I know people do that too. Um, and see how that how that goes. I just want something different and I need to drink some water, so. Put some ice in it. I don't always drink it. Actually, I rarely drink it with ice. Um, but sometimes that's a little change up too. We got this thing not that long ago to um, put the water through that way. We can use water from the sink, but it goes through here to purify it and everything. That way it's not, you know, anything gross in there. <laughs> I cut them a little bit, I think. Okay, I'm gonna put them down in there. Just took a drink, it's not bad. I like it better than lemon water. I'm not a huge fan of lemon water. I like lime water better than lemon water. Lemon water is okay. I like lime better, but this is pretty good. It'd be really good with sparkling water. Actually, if you get sparkling water at Sonic with flavor, they put strawberries in it like that if you get that flavor. So I am 12 weeks pregnant today. I'm going to film a... Um, pregnancy update it'll be the last one for the first trimester i'm gonna start posting the other ones today because i pre-filmed some before i made the announcement um but anyway on my little app here's one of the apps this app is called sprout i don't pay for it i just have like the free version so i can't do all the things but um this is a little baby picture on there and um I also use Baby Center. So I use Sprout. I like the pictures on Sprout because they're like, well, if you pay for it, they're like 3D. You can like move around and see different parts and everything, which in the beginning I had that because they gave you like a free trial. Um, but it's still really cool. They're like really realistic pictures that look like real, you know what I mean? Like not just the like cartoony kind, like they look legit. Um, and so I really like that one, but this is the one on Baby Center, which actually it's pretty good too. Um, this one on there, I like this app a lot, but this one, it really goes in detail on Baby Center about like what is going on on the baby. It says that the baby's fingers will soon begin to open and close, his toes will curl, his eyes, uh, muscles will clench, keep saying his, maybe it's a prophecy. <laughs> His eye muscles will clench and his mouth will make sucking movements and um, has 10 fingers and toes, no more webbing. So our doctor told us at the 10 week appointment that by 11 weeks, the baby actually has everything um, that the baby needs. It just keeps growing like the, you know, everything just keeps growing from that point. My mom's calling me. We'll finish this in a minute. <laughs> Hello. 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 What are you doing? I figured you were walking. I'm not walking, I give it up. I wrapped a few more gifts last night. I decided to do it late after I'd already ended the vlog for the day. Um, but I wanted to show you guys this. I think it's so cute. Um, it's this little gift. I actually can't wait to show you guys. But it's for Manny, obviously. It says, to daddy. Love, baby, Awuku. And um, I told Manny when we woke up this morning the baby had gotten him a gift. <laughs> changed it up a little with this gold wrapping paper i kind of think it goes nicely with it um that's from the dollar store obviously we're fancy we just write right on the packages this is manny's christmas eve gift i end up getting him a little christmas eve package as well and um some other things i haven't shared with you guys yet because i don't want him to see it um but i'll definitely show you everything that i got him when christmas comes because you'll get to see us opening the gifts we always film that but um i have another package coming for him and I have some more in the closet that I need to wrap. <sighs> My hair is like, <sighs> anyway. Um, so yeah, I, this is like not it. Let me put this up real quick. I'm like in full Christmas mode. I am every year. Um, I love Christmas so much. And we are planning, actually this week is gonna be fun for Vlogmas because we're planning some little dates we got actually a gift my um sister sent me a birthday gift and um 
I just got it because it's like one of those like boxes that you get at a certain time of the month. Um, like I think they send them like mid month or something like that. So um, it's a date box and we're gonna go through that I think tomorrow when we have just some time today. We just don't have time and one in the evening after work and everything. Um, I was working a little while ago doing some social media stuff actually, but then um, anyway. So I'm gonna go through that and then we're gonna go on a little ride, get some hot chocolate, look at Christmas lights. We're gonna do some fun stuff Thursday and Friday. Um, but I wanted to finish. I just realized I didn't finish because my mom called. I didn't finish telling you guys about the baby. So I'm uploading right now our uh, first bump date that I pre-filmed at four weeks. I filmed it back in October. Um, but I wanted to go ahead and share some things about the baby. So like I said, um, you know, the doctor had told me like by 11 weeks, everything's there. Just has to continue developing of course um so now we're 12 weeks and so almost out of the first trimester and by the end like this is our last week in the first trimester so the end of 12 weeks you're like done with the first trimester so that's really crazy i'm noticing more and more of a little tiny belly it's not probably as noticeable to everybody else yet but i can really see it especially when i pull my shirt up manny's starting to notice that um i'll try to show you guys yeah so baby's growing and um i'm still feeling amazing this has been the easiest first trimester ever like i just i am so thankful for that would have been thankful no matter what of course because we're just so excited and honestly i didn't expect it to be as easy as it has been because i know most people have like a harder time but we're so thankful that it was just easy and um because even though i wouldn't of course like i would not mind if i was sick or i would just take anything for this baby but of course it's a good thing that like i wasn't sick um because you know you don't want to lose too much weight you know there are some health concerns if you get extremely sick and so i don't have to worry about that when i first got pregnant i actually had lost a pound and i don't know how that happened like i was eating a lot i mean it wasn't anything to worry about it just you know my weight fluctuates always has but um so far in the first trimester they told me i could like gain six pounds and then 12 for the second trimester and 12 for the third is what they like kind of recommended. Um, like that's how the doctor kind of broke it down for me. So the first trimester I gained give or take three pounds. Um, and some days it's less than that. You know, some days it's like two, some days it's almost like I didn't. So I've not really gained a lot of weight yet. Um, but today I weighed myself, I think it was today I weighed myself with my like clothes on it was three pounds so i've probably in all reality gained maybe two pounds um like without clothes and everything because actually makes a pretty big difference um and so yeah that's how the weight gain is going i'm not concerned about gaining weight i mean of course you want it to be a healthy amount but um i will definitely you know make smart choices and not like go overboard but i'm not of course i want to gain weight because you are supposed to gain weight um, when you're pregnant and that's, you know, a healthy thing to do. So I want to make sure that, you know, I'm definitely not limiting myself at all. Um, of course I'm trying to, again, you want to eat healthy and make sure you're nourishing the baby. Um, but I, you know, have really been enjoying food and I've not had any aversions to food. I'm just feel so good. And I'll do a whole pregnancy update for the, um, eight to 12 weeks is my last one in the first trimester. So yeah, I'll film that. But honestly, there's just like, I just feel good. I feel so good. And um, also another thing that the app told me today is that uh, the baby now, when I, if I poke my belly or, you know, obviously I just like lightly poke my belly or something, the baby will respond to that, um, which I think is the coolest thing. I can't obviously feel that right now at 12 weeks. Um, I was feeling some, and I'll probably talk about this in the, in the update, but some of you may not watch both. Um, I was uh feeling like some twitching in my uterus and i'm like at like eight weeks and so i was like there's no way i'm literally feeling this baby which i do believe i'll feel the baby earlier on because i am um i just am really in tune with my body um but it was like it says that's common with growth so can't feel the baby yet but um you know they said that when i poke my belly or whatever you know the baby will move in response to that because it can tell that that's in the not it i hate saying it but you don't know it's boy or girl so it's hard to you know what i mean to say baby every time um but yeah baby will respond to um that little poke or whatever i think that's super cool and we get to see the baby um a couple days before christmas so we're gonna vlog that appointment because they let us do that we've been so blessed with that 
both places, our field clinic and the OB let us film there. So we're gonna film, um, you know, the little ultrasound and everything. I'm super excited. Um, and then after Christmas, a few weeks after that, we'll find out the gender. And then, um, and then uh, 20 something weeks, I think it is, I'll get a, we'll get a uh, either 3D or 4D ultrasound. We're gonna get a few of those and our, our OB doesn't charge extra for that. So we're just super excited. I mean, we would pay extra honestly because I was planning on going to a, a place that does them. It's first pregnancy, miracle pregnancy. I'm gonna get everything I can get out of it, but our OB actually does them without initial cost. So that was a huge blessing too. I can't wait for that. Okay, I just got kind of dressed up because I was taking a picture in front of the tree. It's the first belly picture that I have posted um, on Instagram or anything. I've been taking them every week, but I haven't posted them because honestly, I haven't really seen much of a difference until recently. Obviously, because I'm only 12 weeks, it's not like I have like a huge, you know, belly. The baby's the size of a lime, so it isn't like a gigantic belly, but I do actually have a little belly, and I started noticing, you can see there, I started noticing that I have one because um, it's harder, and when I suck in, like I'm sucking in right now, there's still one there. So, yeah, I just have a little bit of a bump. Um, obviously, it's going to be way bigger, <laughs> but I'm excited to see every little bit of progress and so I wanted to document and not just wait until it's like big you know what I mean I want to kind of document now with my little my little bumpy and I'm not gonna wear this the rest of the day we have used tonight so this would be a little excessive but um, I'm gonna go with some different clothes on I'll probably keep the same makeup on maybe even this hat but wear something different so yeah I just wanted to show you guys I told you I would show you my bump I'll set the camera up kind of um, I love this dress because I feel like since my mom isn't real big yet, this dress helps to show it. Um, but yeah, if you can see here, like I'm trying to suck it in right now. Like I don't need to, I'm not doing it to try to be, you know what I mean? I'm not trying to look thinner. I'm just trying to show you that even it's not all um, low or whatever. It's like there is some little bit of a baby bump there little guy or girl is in there so super exciting i cannot wait to feel these little movements and stuff like i'm just so excited but i'm enjoying every step and i know it's gonna go by so fast um it already is we're already almost the second trimester so i am just trying to savor every moment because i know when i look back once i have the baby i know i'm gonna be so excited to have the baby but I know I'm gonna miss being pregnant because I love being pregnant. I like, I just love it. It's just like the coolest experience of my life. I'm just obsessed with it. So um, I pray that I get to experience it again. Um, but I'm just gonna live every day of this pregnancy enjoying it. So anyway, I'm gonna end today's vlog because we have church tonight and so I need to edit and everything before we go there. But thank you for watching. Remember, you are incredible. Jesus loves you and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.